and share with me how do you feel and what did you learn? I'm very scared, just don't know what I'm going to see today and what right. I'm going to experience today. So it's going to be a new experience for me. The uh, morning when I came in, I was quite nervous. I was thinking what would be going on, you know, how things will go on. Now, now I'm ready to uh, to see dogs, you know. So all my nerves and everything is gone ready because we just need a simple Zumba dance. Thanks. Thank you so much, man. Mindset. Thank you. Chile? Yeah. Um, I think energy is uh, your inner power brain uh, from the inner side of your heart and it's your outside. Inner power. Thank you. Uh, energy is almost everything. Almost everything. Right. What is energy for you? I think energy is support my life. Is it? Support my life. Support your life. Right. How you people and say hi to introduce yourself to the next time? The reason I opened the gate and waited because he is a very happy go lucky dog. Okay, so the way I approach him slow, but the reason I opened the gate is just to invite him. If you guys notice that when I open the gate, okay, 
it create curious for him to come by himself to sniff and get to know about me. And I just waited. So once he used his nose, then I slowly removed the clothes again and removed myself from the zone. But what I did with Sapphire is totally different. The reason I stand next to him first before I open the cage and then the reason why I sat down and then why I open the gate slowly and give him space because he is a very sensitive dog. I need to respect that. He is a four years old dog. Okay, I give him space for him to sniff me. And also he assess because today uh, it's not a usual day for him because we have a crowd here. So he assess everyone. He just waited and he settled down by himself. You can see how slowly he stepped out from the cage after assessing. How do you guys feel after seeing these two boys? But the objective is for you to go inside, put the leash on him and control him. She's looking at me now. Okay. <laughs> but she's looking at me when I mention her name. How is he now? She's relaxed. She's relaxed? That's a good one. Let's give a round of applause, guys. Share with us what is going on. Now. I think you're taking him for a woman, I think. <laughs> Yeah. Is this a good is this a good behavior guys? No. No. Can you see the difference in the dog now? <laughs> so can you see that so Sony Miss Sony is just ignoring? That is a very very good move and by walking and by ignoring. Yeah, that's a good move. So I remove the leash now, okay? So the first thing you guys need to understand, don't rush when you confront your dog. Don't rush. If you have something to done after you are done with your dog, please spare your time with, for your dog. Always don't rush when you have your dog, okay? Do it slowly, patiently. You, you need you need to be patient. The leash it will look like P. The letter P. Okay. So now she sits voluntarily. <laughs> so nice of her. I pet her. Say thank you. It need to be under the door. And to the ears. Why? That is the sensitive area. This is where the mother dog will correct her puppy. She will grab when the puppy misbehaves. She will correct in this area. 